As investigations continue into the attack by suspected allied Democratic Front ADF rebels on Luviriha Secondary School in Mpondwe proceed, the police have arrested 20 people, including two school administrators, for questioning over the attack on the night of 16th June 2023. At least 20 arrests have been made of suspected collaborators. Suspected ADF collaborators. We also have the head teacher and the director of school. As part of our inquiries, they need to uh, give us answers uh, to certain questions. Enanga said of the 42 people who were killed in the attack, 37 were students, the school watchman, two others and a 96-year-old peasant who was killed at the nearby village as the attackers fled the scene. Enanga added that of the 25 charred bodies that were examined at Buera Hospital, 23 were handed over to their immediate family members, while the other two bodies have not yet been picked. On the 18th of June, our medical and forensic teams also examined the 17 bodies from the mortuary in Fort Porto, all the 17 burnt bodies were male, and the bands were distributed all over the body, the front, the back. And uh, one of the victims had an additional gunshot wound, which means they shot at him while inside the dormitory before they burnt it. Another one had dry flames. That is dense soot in the air where he was breathing the, the dry, hot flames. We still have... Uh, uh, six people who uh, remain injured and in hospital. Uh, four of them remain in Vuera. One was transferred in critical condition to Chirudu, and an additional one was transferred to uh, Murago National Referral Hospital. He reassured the public of the determination of security agencies to prevent terror attacks as the UPDF and other security teams put efforts in tracking the ADF rebels. Attack on innocent children is barbaric, is inhuman, and of course constitute, constitute crimes against uh, humanity. As a country, we continue to stand by each other in the fight against terrorism and terrorists, no matter how heinous the attack or how brutal or inhumane the methods used, like the way they burnt these innocent uh, students, they will not uh, they will not succeed uh, in destroying or demolishing our solidarity as a country. The pursuit by the UPDF is still uh, ongoing. At a later stage, we believe they will uh, brief the country on uh, uh, the counter operation. On 18th June 2023, President Yuri Museveni revealed that the UPDF would deploy more troops inside the DRC to fight ADF rebels. The group has been designated by the U.S. as a terrorist outfit, working together with the Islamic State in DRC as its affiliate in Central Africa. Mary Prima Awar, Church of Uganda Family TV, News at 8.